The legislative session is underway in Indianapolis, which means our weekly State House Wrap Report is back. The first bill we're highlighting this session connects to the future Vigo County Casino. Local state, re state Rep Alan Morrison authored the bill. It would prohibit hold harmless agreements, which allow for a government unit to offset financial losses caused by a casino or other government unit. It would also repeal a requirement regarding payments from a gaming operator in Vigo County to Evansville. Both of these agreements were made in the original Gaming Matters bill that passed in 2019. This bill is currently being reviewed in the Committee on Public Policy. Another bill authored by a local legislator aims to conduct an audit on computer election equipment in some Indiana counties. Senator John Ford is behind this legislation. It would require the Secretary of State to conduct a pilot audit of all computer equipment used at the 2022 general election in 10 pilot counties. Vigo County is listed as one of those counties. The audit would take place post Post-election, the Committee on Elections is reviewing the bill now. And another bill proposed this session would expand cold beer sales in the Hoosier State. Senator Philip Boots is proposing a repeal of provisions that stop a grocery store, including a convenience store or drugstore, from selling and delivering cold beer for carryout. Boots proposed similar legislation in 2021, but the bill failed to make it out of the State House. The current bill is under review in the Committee on Public Policy.